Hey everybody, it's Teresa from Teresa's Adventure, nurse, baker, and adventurer, 65 years old. I used to say uh, still working full time, but as of yesterday, I uh, quit my job and I will be getting another one. It's just, I'm a nurse and there are things that sometimes you just can't go along with some things. I'll just leave it at that. And so... You know, it goes for any job. If you feel unsafe, if you feel that you're at risk, your residents are at risk, then it's, yeah, it's time to move on. So anyway, um, I haven't been on here in a few days, and so I just wanted to give you a little update. Oh, my reflectix is on the floor. Okay, so things first here well I gotta clean this up so if you guys want to come along with me <laughs> it's not a whole lot but I, it's still a mess um, I finished the bed I don't think I showed that the bed frame I should say and that's uh, I think 23 inches off the floor and these legs are double if you can see there's two pieces of a uh, three quarter inch no two by fours those are two by fours and then I put three screws in each leg uh, so I haven't really been back out here so oh, since yesterday well yesterday I came out and if, I don't know if I can show you this if I can find how to insert pictures I will do that because this came from out of my house I actually drug it from <laughs> over there I put it on a on a quilt or a blanket or whatever and I drug it from there and got here to the van and I was trying to figure out how in the world am I going to do this and so then I thought about turning it up on its end so I got it close as it could get to the steps I turned it long ways on the end and then just uh, eased it down in here as you can see, I got tape on the doors. I had to tape the door shut so that doesn't uh, so they didn't come open and and break. And oh, this this is what I did. That's what I did yesterday. This piece here, and I'll have this will be my sink and partial countertop. That noise you hear is this uh, bread on the back of my head scraping on the top of the ceiling. But anyway, <clears throat> over here where this piece of paper is, I think this is where I'll put my bowl and I think the sink bowl I'm going to have it like a decorative bowl and I'm going to have it on top and then have a hole go through and then under here let's see if I can get this tape off the tape's pretty on there pretty good well I'll have to show that in another one let me see I don't even know if I'm if I got it in camera view yeah so oop. this is a this came off the shelf came off from me doing all of that I can go back on but honestly I don't think I'm gonna put have a shelf in here because this is where my gray water and uh, and drinking water that's where it's gonna be I'm gonna get those two five gallon jugs and so that's where this this part here will be the sink part and then there's plenty of storage for like even if uh, I guess I didn't clean it out as well as I thought I did but there's plenty of storage for like a little pantry down here and also over here I'm gonna put this back up because I do want that to be I do want that to have shelves but yeah it's pretty much storage in the counter space will be pretty decent and I do have an, a piece of plywood if I want it to extend over here where the wheel well is i'm going to make a eventually i'm going to make a box to box that in it shouldn't take much to do that so i'm just going to box that in and then same thing over here i'm going to box that wheel well in i'm going to get uh, probably just plastic drawers like see these two things these two uh garment bags down there those open up into like a big box shape one of them i'm gonna have for like um personal 
belongings like paperwork and stuff that I need. And the other one, I think I'll switch out between like winter and summer clothes. And then I'll have, um, I'll have one of those. I don't know if I'm going to go with the plastic container for here or not. I'm going to go to like home goods or someplace or at home and, and see what they have. And so, yeah, that's what I'm going to do with that. And this is my Reflectix. Like I said, it's, it's not really staying in the window. Here, let me try to put this down so you can see it. Let me see here where am I at? Hold on. Bear with me here because no idea what I'm doing here. Anyway, um, I'll figure it out once I get it in my hand here. Oh, jeez, it was. Where in the world did it go to? Alright, sorry about that. Jeez, ah, I had the whole thing flipped the wrong wall. No wonder I couldn't find it. I had that camera flipped the wrong wrong. Alright, so... I had a roll of Reflectix. This actually, this Reflectix. It's not even wasn't even that big of a roll, but there was a lot on there because I padded the uh, wheel wells with it, and then I made um, one, two, three of these huge window coverings. These windows are really big back here. Let me see if I can get this to stay in for a second. So you can see. But anyway, um, yeah, that's, that's that. And what I'm going to do, I bought, um, let me find it here. Oh, it's hot out here. I bought fabric. I bought this black fabric here. It's a uh, fleece. I bought that. And that's going to go on the outside, of course. And then I bought this. I thought it looked like, I don't know what I thought it looked like. Almost like a starry night or something because of the blue. And then the, I don't know if you can see that gold color in there. But I thought that would look nice on the inside. So that's what I'm up to. Um, my next step is to finish these. Oh, man, it's hot out here. Sorry, I got a sweatshirt on because I've been up all morning. It was a little chilly this morning, but now it's, uh, now it's a little warm. It's like in the, it's like 63 today. And I'm in Pennsylvania, so. Yeah, so here I am. Oh, Lord have mercy. So that's what, that's about all that I'm up to. I'm so glad I got this, um sink piece in because that was rough and I did it by myself I had a friend that was supposed to come over and help me but he kept delaying it which I mean you know people are busy and uh he wanted to do it like at six o'clock in the evening I'm like I don't want to mess with this thing in the dark so I just uh thought about it thought about it prayed about it <laughs> and, and then uh finally I got it in here so there you go girl power but I, uh, yeah, I got it done. So that's that. I just have to finish my cover, my window, my Reflectix and put the uh, fabric on it. And that'll make it stay in better too once I get that fabric on there. So I'm going to do that. And then, let me shut these cabinets back up. Oh, I have to get U-bolts to put on the bottom. I'll show you the legs on here, which is really nice that how the legs are. I don't know if you can see that, but the legs are so that I can put uh, like a U-bolt because if I forget to bolt that down, there's gonna, I'm going to be in big trouble if I forget to bolt that down. So I am going to clean up this mess in here and this is the fabric. I'm going to put this back in the bag, in the bag here. I'm going to have to get because this isn't going to be enough. This might be enough to do this. Let me take this 
up here. Sorry about the noise. Now this, let me see if it'll fit in this back window. Nope, it's not even enough for that window. These two, um, let me flip it. Like this little window back here. Well, actually, I'm forgetting about the far back windows. So, yeah, I am going to have to get, definitely get another roll. Because I have two side windows back here. There's a lot of windows in here. Two side windows and then two back windows to do with the Reflectix yet. And also, what I'm going to do, let me, what I'm going to do is, I bought this foam board, thinking I could, I was going to use this on the walls, but nah, I'm not going to do that. That's, I would have to rip all this plastic out, and I can't do all of that because I already have the floors in. I already got this bed frame up, and even though it's not bolted down or anything, it still would be a, a big pain in the butt to try to get that done. So I'm not doing that either. But what I am going to do, and it's going to take space, head space from me, but uh, I'm going to take this uh, this foam board and put it on the bed as a barrier. And I'm still going to get that tool to, um, to drill holes in the plywood so that um, so it can be aerated. And there won't be a problem with the foam board because it'll go right through the foam board and through the, the plywood. So that won't be a problem either. But anyway, that's about all I came on here for. Just to keep in touch to let you guys know that I'm still here. Uh, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it if you guys could give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And until the next time, I'll give you an update. All right. Bye.